What's up everybody, do right back at it again with another video. Today we're going to be talking about Six Days in Fallujah because there was a couple of videos that were released exclusively to YouTubers that were veterans, like actual veterans in the military. The reason why that is is because this game was definitely looking for people who have actually fought in the war, but I'm not sure if it was specifically for Fallujah or if it's just, you know, anybody that's a veteran. But yeah, the people that released this, or at least that I've seen, are uh, Controlled Pairs and Glid Gaming. Oh, also Devil Dog Gamer. They they ended up releasing gameplay because they're veterans so that's pretty cool it shows that they definitely care about the game so we're just gonna kind of look through it and talk about it this is the video from controlled pairs i hope he doesn't mind that i'm using this but yeah so the first thing that i want to say is that there's definitely a guy that's kind of like looking through it's gonna happen when there's like ragdoll physics and stuff we're just gonna back it up a bit here oh nice shot by controlled pairs with you garage so I guess they shot this guy before, and he's just kind of like hanging out there. Shooter 12 o'clock, 100 meters. He nicked him right there. Or at least I think he did. Ooh, grenade launcher. Thank you, sir. You're good to push, G-Man. Go. We're moving. With you. I'm not sure I like the A that's above the head here. It's a little too much in my opinion. Like maybe if they made it a little smaller, you know, we like to have that minimalistic stuff or maybe just not show it at all, you know, have a button that, you know, conceals it. And this right here, I assume is like the objective marker. If I, I had to guess, maybe not too sure. Breach, breach, breach. I'm with you, Gina. I'm not sure what he was shooting at there, but it looked like he was shooting behind the building. Get in there. We're internal. So he has a shotgun. That's pretty cool. Yeah. All right. With you. I gotta say that this game looks really, you know, just looks gorgeous, by the way. And this is all randomly generated, too, which is cool. One down mid. Took out that guy. That was pretty cool. Oh, there's a guy right here. I don't know if he sees him. Oh, I'm hurt. Oh, he doesn't see him. <laughs> Bandaging. <laughs> Okay, so it's showing off a bandaging system, so he can bandage himself, and what is this? Some sort of compass? He went up the stairs. The stairs are broken. He's on the second level. Understood. I'm in. What are you shooting that, buddy? Oh, you saw that guy. I didn't see him. He's down. He's down. Mag. Hug the wall, hug the wall, hug the wall. Man, it is hard to see people in this stuff. I mean, it's hard to see on video. I guess it would look a lot better if I was in the game, but... Seems like the AI is really good. Hey, I just took contact off my muzzle. Watch my left. Murder hole's right. Keep pushing. Our breach is black side. I'm stacked. We're with you. Moving. Alright, we're in. Oh shit! Damn. I'm hurt. Oof. Oh, well, that's pretty cool. Oh. Push my long, please. What the hell? Did they both just die right there? That's pretty cool. You could actually see him uh, getting bandaged. That's pretty cool. Is yes, I'm looking right. Got your long. Trust in the dream. Mover, twelve o'clock. He's down. I like how the AI is actually getting out of the buildings and like going to other buildings. Like it makes it feel more like a war zone, you know, instead of just like, you know, reskin ready or not. That'd be great. You two on the roof, Grover, you're with me. We're going to the target building. Cover our approach, break down when we get to the wall. Ready? We're established rooftop. Ready. Move it. Oh, Jesus. Mag, we're on the way. It is hard to see what he's shooting at. To be honest. We're holding, ready to push second floor. Careful when you come inside. We are on the northwest corner. Eagles internal. Eagles, eagles, eagles. 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 We're moving second floor. Shotgun, you're on point. Bypass, bypass. Assault the Al Qaeda compound and secure the LRP. Okay, interesting. Flag's coming down. Gotcha. I think I know Ooh, taking down a flag? <laughs> Troops in contact, rooftop, heavy. What was that? Did he call down a mortar or something? Interesting. Oh, man, Coming down. To you. 
Gunbird is hurt, bandaging. Oh my god. Can I see that again? What the hell? Gunbird is hurt, bandaging. It looked like his arm shrinks right here, and then like the bandage comes out. That looks freaking weird. <laughs> it's cool, but it looks weird. Well, if you need help, I'm working internal staircase. Try out. Oh, you can throw grenades. Nice. Ouch. Come to you, get Oh, he's limping. That's oh damn. What's wrong with his face? Is it not loading in? Cover. G man's hurt banging. Oh, he's doing his other one now. Oh damn, you could get like bandaged on all sides. What happens if you get hit again? Do you have to bandage his leg? Cover, check in. Animation looks good. Cover, check in when able. Grover, you live? I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Just engage one on stairwell. Dead squad. I am not in convoys on site. Let's, Let's go. Nice job. We're making sure the compound is clear. Is that in here, Spartan? Oh, what was that? So they made sure that the compound was clear. It says, hold the compound or repel insurgent attack. Okay, so I guess that's where they're at until help arrives, I assume. I got voices. We're working, right? I got no flashlights in here. Left. I like how the AI doesn't like peek around the corner. They just like put their gun around. That's pretty cool. Dude, blind firing right there. Oh, you can shoot through walls. Nice. I got nothing in the uh, alleyway. Oh shit, mortar. Oh, fuck. We gotta push. Run, run. Dusty as shit. Maybe it's just me, but if it was, like, really dusty, I think I would wait to see if, um, you know, anything pops out before I push into that. Because that was a lot of just fog and dust or whatever. Top Worth left, it. top left. This gets complicated over here. Audible right. I'm plating. Push stairs. This is a very gorgeous looking game, by the way. The only thing that I really have issues with is just like the American models, like they feel a bit dated, but aside from that, like this looks really good. Ooh, nice One shot. Down right. Pushing. Taking shots, cover. Paris here says that he only played one mode, apparently there's more than one, and it's a simple one where you go and you clear or you, you know, attack a specific thing, so that's pretty cool. There's multiple modes, it's it's great for a co-op game, you know, you definitely need to have more modes to make it interesting, and they're procedurally presented, obviously. So that's pretty cool. This is definitely a game that I want to check out, wish I could get access to it, but you know, I'm not a veteran, unfortunately. It is what it is. But what are your guys' thoughts? Uh, I'll have a link to Controlled Pairs' video if you want to hear his whole talk about it. I thought that this this gameplay was pretty cool. I don't really think I have any problems with it aside from, you know, just the model, but uh, you know, that's like such a minor issue. But yeah, that's pretty much what I think about it. Again, if you want to watch Control Pairs video, I'll have a link to that. And uh, yeah, I guess I'll see you in the next one. Be sure to become a member if you want to see exclusive content behind the scenes and all that. And uh, yeah, I guess I'll talk to you some other time. Subscribe and do all that. Bye bye.